and I have a rubber snake fishing line. It's kind of a snaky environment, and my friend's a little jumpy. Yo, show the snake! What are you looking at me for? Look! Today's video is absolutely incredible. We're going out some great action uh, with a string trimmer and great editing by Matter. But the most amazing part is my friend Paul's here with me. If you know Paul, uh, he's quite a character, and I got him with a rubber snake, and he is terrified of snakes. You got to see it in this video. It's absolutely hilarious. Let's get started right now. All right, I've got a crazy surprise for today's video. We're going to be down in this creek. Uh, weed eating these really tall grass. I think it's gonna be great, but I've got a, a secret surprise. I got a friend coming to help me and here's what I'm gonna do, okay? We'll see if this works or not. But I have a rubber snake, fake snake, okay? Now this creek, we actually get real snakes in here and it, it's kind of a snaky environment and my friend's a little jumpy, okay? So I've got a, a snake and I've got fishing line tied to the snake, okay? So I can't decide if I'm gonna tie it to his head or his tail. Right now I got it tied to his tail, but I was thinking about hanging it from this bridge right here or a tree limb or something. And while he's down there weed eating, dropping the snake and letting it kind of bump him on the shoulder and I hope he goes crazy. Now I don't want to stage this. Obviously I'm staging the snake. I don't want to stage his reaction. I want it to be 100% natural. So we'll see if I can pull it off, whether I have to do it from the tree or maybe tie it to his head and, and put it on the ground and drag it in front of him. But I'm gonna try to pull this snake trick off on my friend as he uh, is down in this creek weed eating tall grass. So let's see if we can make it happen. Okay, I don't think I'm gonna be able to do it from a tree. So I, I put it uh, here on the ground. I've got the fishing line tied to it. And, and the hope is I've got the fishing line on the other side of the creek there. So as I'm over here, hopefully filming with the camera, get the camera set up. As he is uh, coming through here with his weed eater, gets to about right here, I can pull that snake out. And uh, I, you know, I just wanna see the reaction. So hopefully it's gonna work, we'll see. It may, I can't guarantee it, but we're gonna give it a try. All right, my friend Paul just got here and he uh, told him we might uh, do some, some trimming in that creek. He said, do I need my snake boots? I said, oh no, it's not that bad, you know. So anyway, uh, I think, uh, it's kind of funny because snakes are on his mind when he saw that creek so we'll see if we can make this happen let's try it all right here's our friend paul we're gonna uh, get out here and do do some trimming in this creek it's kind of overgrown uh, i told paul he asked about rattlesnakes. said no we I, we have seen like a little snake in there but we have never seen a poisonous snake and we've been living here for three years so anyway um, but we're just gonna get it clean. I gotta keep this weedy because it gets all overgrown and nasty. I've got some waterproof boots on. Paul's got tennis shoes, so I'm gonna, anyway, I'm gonna let Paul do some of the part that he can stand on in parts that are uh, a little bit wetter. Um, I'll be able to get those with my, my boots on. So anyway, we're gonna get to work. Let's get started. Let's
You didn't tell me there's a snake hole over there. <laughs> Paul said I didn't tell him there was a Come snake here. hole. Come here. He's what claiming there's a snake I hole. I said, Jason, is there any snakes out here in Alabama? Look, look. Oh, uh, let's just put your finger in there. We got, we got, what's in there, man? We got chipmunks, too. Oh, chipmunks. Oh, we got chipmunks. Just keep working. You're All getting right. distracted. Yes, sir. Getting ready to do the snake. We're gonna. This is gonna be hilarious if it works. I promise. I hadn't even brought up snakes to him. He's the one that keeps bringing it up because this looks so snaky. You could probably get this tall stuff here and then get down here and do a little bit more, and then we could trade out. This weeders actually are pretty good. My first time using battery powered on something this is good. Yeah. Do just a little bit more and it will switch. Oh, fuck! I don't want to make it, Look at this thing! Fuck! Fuck! Damn it! Oh, man! Yeah! Oh, man! Oh, look at him! He's playing dead! Oh, man! Oh, Oh, man! <laughs> Woo! Oh. You're showing the snake. What are you looking at me for? Look! Look! Look at your camera. Look! Oh man! Oh, Paul, oh. I, you, how much money you give me if I grab him with my oh, bare hand? Here. How much money you give me? Uh, how much money for real you give me if I grab him? I got ten bucks in my pocket. I'll give you five. I've caught snakes before. Oh my gosh! No! No! Stop! No! 
<laughs> and then you started talking about snakes. I thought, oh boy, this is gonna be hilarious. <laughs> Cause I had some fishing string tied to it. And I said, when it gets close, I'm gonna bring it down there. Are you sure it's recording? Huh? It better be recording. Yeah, it is. I thought if I could get, when you said something about snakes, I thought this is gonna be so funny. Oh, man. <laughs> Oh man. We actually do have snakes in this creek, but this one is rubber. Oh man. <laughs> All right, let me show the camera. Here's the one that just nearly ended, barely bit as a uh, water moccasin mm. viper cotton mouth. It nearly ended Paul's life. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> <laughs> Caused me a heart attack laughing so oh. hard. All right, let's get to where I just did that because I thought it'd be hilarious. I was hilarious. like, why, why are you telling me to keep going? Yeah, I was like, I was like a little bit further, Paul. Come on down a little bit oh. further. Because I just had a feeling when you started talking about snakes, I thought this is going to be hilarious. I almost strung it from a tree and had oh. it fall down on you. Ooh. Anyway. All right, Emil, let's get back to work. When that thing hit Paul, my cheek, Paul I got so throwed his weed eater in the bed. <laughs> threw it in the creek. <laughs> oh my I, gosh. I know. Uh, I hope he didn't ruin the battery. I hope this thing still works. <laughs> he didn't ruin the battery oh, on his weed eater. Oh, How's man. Al Blaze make it look so easy, man? Man, I got. I forgot my sunglasses. Oh, I got. Oh, my God. 
right, we got the creek, uh, got the, the tall grass knocked down, weeds in there, there was all kind of stuff, Chinese privet and all kind of stuff, just wanted to show you, appreciate you guys watching the video, there's other transformation videos on this one, if you thought the snake part was hilarious, I would ask you to like the video, leave it a comment and share it um, with other people because I thought that was uh, worth a laugh. I, I, I wasn't sure it was gonna work, but I felt like it worked about as good as I could hope for it was. When, he, when Paul went nuts is when I grabbed the snake and threw it at him, and he just screamed and threw his uh, trimmer in the water and everything, so it was pretty funny. So, appreciate you guys watching. We'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching the video. If you thought that was hilarious, you might also enjoy the one where Paul it slips and falls on the hill not once not twice but three times it's popping up on your screen now paul's also got a channel where he's doing uh, some similar videos i'll put a link to paul's channel in the description i'm jason creel at fix the lawn thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video